My name's Colt. Today we're on the giddy up. We're heading down to that pasture and we're gonna tear out some old fence. Cows been jumping over it, under it. They've been going through it. So we're gonna rip it out with our bobcat. We got the attachment with the chain on there. We're gonna rip that out. Then we're gonna put in some new and uh, hopefully it'll hold in the cattle. Stay tuned. We got here to the south farm. Had to open a gate. Dad's taking off. It's a little muddy, so we got her in four, and he's gonna go fast. And I got the side by side here. We like to have either a four wheeler or, a, or our side by side with us when we're fencing. That way, we can run quickly up and down the fence. So the plan is, we got this short stretch here. All three of these wires are decent. And so we're gonna throw them back after we take them off. And then we're gonna rip out all this, all this garbage. I really hate this woven wire because it gets down in the dirt. The snow pushes it down and then the cattle climb through between that and the barb. Yeah, and it, it's never fun pulling out. That's why we always just use the skid loader and tear it out. Is this corner fine? Yep. Yeah. So, shouldn't take too long. We'll get it tore out and we don't even have to set any H braces. So we're gonna start with taking off the wires. When working with barbed wire, you always find the holes in your gloves. It usually doesn't feel very good. We got those first three wires thrown over the back. Dad's working on getting it disconnected from that other corner over there. What I've been doing is just kind of throwing it over to the side a little bit, getting it out of the way. And then now I'm gonna put the forks back on the skid loader and start tearing it out. We got it all tore out and now we just have to roll up that woven wire there's a couple bent posts in it there's a wood down there but this is the uh this is the worst part you think dad yep yeah try not to get poked and i don't know it's a short run but when it's longer it starts getting a little heavy and you kind of cut it into a few different rolls but we should be able to get this in one roll right cow So we got all three of these wires that were already here tightened up and strung across and so we're just gonna 
So now we're gonna lay out our uh, T-posts and our wood posts where we're gonna put them. Then we're gonna put the hammer back on the bobcat and start pounding them in. So how far are you stepping and what's the difference? Well, distance five between? steps is a rod, 16 and a half feet, I figure. Okay. It's about 15 to 16 and a half feet. So I'm just trying to big, take big steps and make it a rod every post. All these posts are laid out. Like I said, we got to put the hammer back on the bobcat and uh, we'll start pounding them. Sun's starting to go down. It is four o'clock and so it'll be dark in an hour and a half. So I think we should be able to pound these in, get the staples in all of them, and then hopefully string that last wire. And then tomorrow we're gonna come back, we're gonna start tearing out that fence along these trees. Because right now there's actually a cow in there that hopped the fence. And that fence been that fence has been bad for about four years. So we got all the posts in. That's pretty straight. You should look down this, it's pretty good. Now we're gonna start stapling the wires to all of the posts. Um, probably gonna start about two notches down, go down about five more, probably five more, and might be four or five on the last one that we still have to string. Geez, Dad, what happened here? Not your best work. Everything's stapled up. We're just gonna run that last wire, and we don't have the tractor here, so we're just gonna run a bar through the the roll of wire and walk it down. But it's it's a short run. Plus, it's only like a half roll, so it's not gonna be. How much do one of them weigh? Four hundred. Yeah, about four hundred pounds. So. <laughs> We got the fourth wire strung up and now we're just gonna staple it up like we've been doing and this fence will be done and so that'll be two fences in two days and like you said we're gonna start tearing that one out tomorrow sun's about going down there's a lot of gunfire right now because uh opening deer season was yesterday and so uh it's kind of kind of scary just standing outside and hearing a lot of gunfire kind of suck getting hit wouldn't be the best day. I guess dad didn't like me making fun of his crappy stapling abilities. So that fence is done. We're gonna pack up and head out. Sun's going down. Dad's got a Packers game he wants to watch. So thanks for watching today. Hope you enjoyed it. Tomorrow we're gonna start tearing that fence out and uh, probably make another video of that. He'll probably be sick of watching me tearing out fence and putting in new fence. But see you next time. Mm -hmm.